because there are some lions just ahead of us. But they seem to have... One has just got up and moved off. So let me creep forward a little bit and see if I don't have any luck getting you a glimpse of him. Now I'm told there were five here. Oh, well, let's stop and get you... Actually, there's one just a little bit forward here, VM. Let me go back a bit. There's one somewhere in that bush over there that VM was pointing at. But here we go, here we're going to get you a much better view. There we go. Hello, boy. So, looks to be a fairly young male. And so did the other one I saw earlier. It'll be interesting to see what the other three look like. It'll also be interesting to see how full their bellies are. Because if they're very hungry, we might be lucky enough to see them go out looking for some wildebeest. There are wildebeest literally surrounding us. We're in a bit of a thicket where we are, but around us there's a sea of open grassland. So there's lots of food around, but his belly does look fairly full, but he could definitely squeeze some more wildebeest in there if he needs to. Now, just a reminder, please do, especially for the school kids, please ask your teacher lots and lots of questions, and then they will send them on to us. It'll be great to answer your questions and to talk to you guys and see, 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 what, uh, see what happens, see where the afternoon takes us. I'm actually going to be spending the whole night out here with VM, the cameraman. We're going to be following the lions the whole night, so that's very exciting. So what we're probably going to do is just spend a few more minutes with them, try and get you a few more better views. And once we've done that, then we're going to take you on a little bit of a drive. Oh, let's just stop here. There's an animal walking across the clearing straight in front of us there, VM. Oh, not that one. I think it's just disappeared behind a bush to the left. Let me go into a gap. There was a hyena walking along in the distance. There are so, so many animals here. You literally don't know where to look. And there's going to be...